This is part 2 of a tutorial on how to make a model of Mr. Spock. In the outliner window, click on the eye icons to hide the head and the body. In the view menu, go to the front view. Add mesh cube. Turn shading to wireframe. Use the tip of the blue arrow to move the cube up and the tip of the red arrow to move the cube over the arm. Shift and drag with the middle mouse button to pan and zoom in with the mouse wheel. I'm going to enter values for scale 0.251 for X, 0.251 and 0.471. Press G to grab just to show that that scale is correct and now I'm ready to UV map. In the object menu apply scale, drag with the middle mouse button to rotate the view, drag on the white diagonal lines to open up a new window and make the new window a UV image editor window. Click on the button to access already opened images, zoom back with the mouse wheel. Now if we look at the template for the arm, it's slightly different to the head where the top and the bottom of the model both come off the same side. The top and the bottom come off different sides here, so we're going to have to mark different seams. Go into edit mode. Arbitrarily, I'm going to call this the front of the model, and there is one side before you have the cut. So if this is the front, the cut, I think, will be there. The bottom flap comes off the front, so I'm holding down shift and selecting those three but the top flap comes off the side on the right as we look at it so I think holding down shift I have to select these three mesh edges mark edges as seams press A twice to select all mesh menu UV unwrap unwrap in the view menu toggle full screen Press S to scale, 0.246, and enter. G to grab and move that over the arm. Shift, drag with middle mouse button to pan. Zoom in with the mouse wheel, shift middle mouse button to pan. G followed by Y to fine tune in the vertical position. G followed by X to fine tune horizontally. And that's UV mapped. In the view menu, toggle full screen. Drag on the white diagonal lines to close the UV image editing window. Go into object mode. I can set the Z location to be zero and enter. Zoom back with the mouse wheel. And the X location to be minus 0.9 and enter. Shift and drag with the middle mouse button to pan and zoom in with the mouse wheel. Change shading to texture. I'm going to duplicate the arm, hold down shift and press D and enter and change the X location of the duplicate to 0.9 by deleting the minus sign. I'm going to name the arm on the right arm underscore L for left because it's the character's left arm. Drag with the middle mouse button. This part of the texture should be facing inwards. To fix that Press R to rotate, Z, 90, and enter. Select the other arm, R to rotate, Z, minus 90, and enter. Name the arm on the left, arm underscore R for right. Hold down shift and select both arms. In the object menu, apply rotation. 